Hey what is happening guys, Chris here and today I'll be showing you how to get the secret Korak machete weapon in Dying Light. First you're going to want to head up to the northern part of the slums, to this point on the map, near these three safe houses. And you'll come to a building that looks like this. Walk over to this aircon unit and jump up to it. Turn around to the lamppost on the right and jump over to that. You'll have to aim pretty high if you want to make it, and it might take you a few tries. Climb up to the balcony next to it and turn left. Jump up to the next balcony, run along it and make your way up to the next tier of balconies. Be careful not to fall here, you might have to use this aircon unit as well. Once you're up, run over to the middle section of the balconies and carefully hop up onto the ledge with the plant pots on. Watch out you don't fall over the side. Turn to the roof and climb up. Walk around the back of this middle room with all the boxes and climb over them. Drop down to see a blue box. You'll actually have to kick the box quite a few times before it opens. It took me a couple of minutes but eventually it'll open, revealing the blueprint for the Korak Machete. Then you'll just need to craft it. It takes 10 alcohol and 20 metal parts to make. Just keep scrapping old weapons and looting zombie corpses and fridges to get the alcohol. Once you craft it, you'll be able to find it in your inventory. It has 500 damage, 35 durability and 218 handling. And I should probably mention it's a beast of a weapon and definitely worth trying to get. So that's pretty much it for this guide. Make sure you hit that like button if it helped. Subscribe to my channel to see more guides, reviews and gameplay. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.